Hi, let's design DFA for some more language. First language is number of occurrence of substring 10 and 01 is same. So how many time 10 will present, same time 01 will present. What it will accept? It will accept epsilon. In epsilon 10 is present 0 time, 01 is present 0 time. 0 star, there are also 10 is present 0 time, 01 present 0 time. 1 star for same, both are present 0 time. 101, 10 one is present one time, 01 is present one time. So this 10 and this 01. Then 010, 01 present once, 10 present once. Then 1001, 10 present once, 01 present once. Then 0110, so 01 present once, 10 present once. Then 110001, one, so here 10 one, present once and 01 present once. Then 01001110, zero, 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 one, one, zero. so here 01 present once, 10 one, present once. Then here 01 present once, 10 one, present once, means 01 present two time, 10 present two time. So it will accept strings like this. Initial state will be the final state as it accept epsilon. Then from Q0 by 0, it will go to state Q1. At Q1, there will be self loop. It will accept now 0 stars. Just to accept 0 star, it will be self loop. Now I'll do for 0, 1, 0. So from Q1 by 1, it will go to Q2. And from Q2 by 0, it will come to state Q1. So now it will accept epsilon 0 star. Then 0, 1, 0. So 0, 1, 0. Q2, 0 is there for 1. We can do a self loop. So just make a self loop of 1 because if you will do self loop, then also it will end with 1, 0. So we need 0, 1 or 1, 0. So here also it will be 1, 0. Then for 1, we will make another state from Q0 by 1, it will go to state Q3. At Q3, there will be self loop. It will accept 1 star. Then from Q3 by 0, it will go to state Q4. And from Q4 by 1, it will come to state Q3. So it will be 1, 0, 1. Now it will accept this 1, 0, 1 and 1 star. At Q4, we can make a self loop of 0. So this DFA, if you remember, it is little bit similar to another DFA that was starting and ending with same symbol. There, these two state was final state, but now here we added initial state as final state. So here three final state. In that DFA, there was two final state. If you don't remember, just go through that lecture. So this DFA is same as start and end with same symbol plus epsilon. Okay. Now just check whether it is accepting all the string or not. So epsilon here it will accept zero star zero, then any number of zero zero star one star. Then 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1. Then 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0. Then 1, 1, triple 0, 1. So first one, second one. Then first 0, second 0, third 0, 1. Then this 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0. Then 1 then 0, then 0, 1, 1, 0. So it will accept. So this DFA will accept all the string for number of occurrence of substring 1, 0 and 0, 1 is same. So how many time 1, 0 present? Same time 0, 1 is also present. And here number of state is 5. Next language, the second symbol from left hand is 0. So left means this is left, this is right. So we always write from left to right. And uh, it will accept 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, like this. So here you can mark from the starting, this is the second symbol, this is 0. Here this is 0, 0, 0, then 1, 0, 1, this is 0, 0, 0, 1, this is 0, then 0, triple 0, this is 0, then 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, here this is 0. So you can say W equal to 1 plus, first place can be either 0 and 1, second place is 0, it is fixed. Then uh, after that it can be x, it can be anything. Let's design the DFA for this. First place can be 0 and 1. 
so from q0 by 0 and 1 it will go to state q1 then from q1 by 0 it will go to q2 and this is our second alphabet from left side this is our first alphabet from left side this is our second alphabet and at q2 we can make a self loop of 0 1 so it will accept x means it will accept anything but this is not the DFA. To make it DFA, we will add a dead state. And from Q1 by 1 transaction, it will go to dead state. And at dead state, there will be self loop. Now, this is the DFA that will accept second symbol from left hand is 0. So, let's check 0, 0. So, 0, 0, 1, 0. Then 1, 0, 0. Then 1, 0, 1. Then triple 0, 0, 0, 0. And then 1 0 1 1 triple 1 0 so 1 0 then 1 1 0 so it will accept next language the third symbol from left end is 1 so it will accept 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 1 1 and then 0 0 1 0 1 0 1 1 1 0 1 1 0 0 1 so you can mark the third symbol is this from left this is 1 here this is 1 this is 1 here this is 1, here this is 1, this is 1, 1, then this is 1. After that it can be anything. So you can write W equal to two first alphabet, second alphabet, then third alphabet is 1. These are the places there can be 0 or 1. Here in second place there can be 0 and 1. And third place 1 is fixed then it's X. Let's design DFA for this. From Q0 by 0 and 1, it will go to state Q1. This is our first alphabet. Then from Q1 by 0 and 1, it will go to state Q2. This is our second alphabet. Then from Q2 by 1, it will go to state Q3. This is our third alphabet. So third alphabet from left is 1. Then at Q3, there will be a loop of 0, 1. So now this will accept every string where third symbol from left hand is 1 but this is not a DFA to make it DFA will add a dead state and from Q2 by 0 transaction it will go to dead state and at dead state there will be a self loop of 0 now this is the DFA that will accept every string whose third symbol from left hand is 1 so you can check 001 0, 0, 001 0, 0, 1. then 101101 0, then now uh, 1 1 1 1 1 1 0 1 1 0 1 1 then 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 0 1 0 1 1 1 0 1 then 1 then 1 0 1 1 0 1 so 1 0 1 then for 1 then for 0 then for 0 then for 1 and it will accept so it will accept all the string whose third symbol from left end is 1. The minimal DFA that accept nth symbol from left end is fixed contain n plus 2 state. So there was second symbol. So and it required 1, 2, 3, 4 state. Here it was third symbol it required 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 state. So actually n plus 1 for designing NFA and plus 1 that is for designing the dead state. So n plus 2 state. Thank you.